Well, I'm here at Cool Breeze Caribbean Market in Edgewood, Maryland. This lovely, lovely lady, Lydia, has just sold me some Scotch bonnets, and she said, oh, you think you're tough? Well, let's, uh, let's try one right now. And I said, okay. Let's see. And you said you wanted the? Yellow. The yellow one. Good, because that's supposed that one's hotter, okay. I think. Are we doing the whole thing, or are we just doing a, a bite of it? We're doing a bite of it, or whatever okay. you want to do. Okay. All right, one, two, three. Cheers. Cheers. Hmm. Well, yours is spicy. <coughs> oh, it's, it sits in. Oh, oh God. Take another bite. Take another okay. bite. Can I take one bite? <coughs> oh, my God. I'm telling you, that one is worse. Don't. He bit into the seed. Look at that. That makes it worse. Yeah. How but is it's, that? So, it's so fruity. It's so fruity. That's oh what I love God. about it. It oh. takes me home. Oh, oh Lydia. So good, right? <clears throat> you want your water? I can't, I can't do any more. All right, cool. Later, come down here if you need some of this. The best peppers in the world. Cool Breeze Caribbean Market, 1010 Edgewood Road, Edgewood, Maryland, 21040. Thank you, Charles. Thank you, Lydia. <clears throat> okay, it's about 20 minutes after I had that little scotch bonnet tasting with lovely Lydia. Lovely Lydia, Lydia, oh, lovely. The young lady from Jamaica who sold me those scotch bonnets. I came all the way from New Jersey down to Maryland uh, to buy them. Actually, I'm on my way to Washington, D.C. But anyway, she uh, she said, let's, uh, let's try it together and make a video. And 20 minutes later, my mouth is still on fire. She gave me a nice bottle of some kind of fruit drink, and then I just stopped again. I had to get some more. Now, I'm used to eating hot peppers. For years, I've been eating... Some of the hottest, Carolina Reapers, Ghost Peppers, but the Scotch Bonnets are not the hottest, but they are unbelievably delicious, fruitful, smoky, just like I ate it, ate it there. Anyway, if you ever get a chance to try a fresh Scotch Bonnet, have at it.